ओके नाउ वीव गॉट सेक्शन टू हम थोड़ा जब बूथा बनेगा उसके बाद आहिस्ता आहिस्ता ज्यादा बनेगा फिर और ज्यादा बनेगा सेक्शन टू बट डोंट वरी आई मीन इफ यू आर लुकिंग फॉर हायर बेंड स्कोर सेक्शन वन एंड टू ट्वेंटी बाई ट्वेंटी नो कॉम्प्रोमाइज हियर वेन यू आर डूइंग प्रैक्टिस फ्रॉम केम्ब्रिज आयल्स बुक्स सेक्शन वन एंड टू यू मस्ट गेट ट्वेंटी जस्ट वन मिस्टेक मे बी नाइनटीन बट अदरवाइज ट्वेंटी ओके सो लेट्स टेक अ स्टार्ट सेक्शन टू क्वेश्चन इलेवन टू ट्वेंटी Questions eleven to thirteen. Write no more than three words for each answer. There is no number. No more than three words for each answer. Question number eleven. The land for development has not been used for over a. Now underline over. Land has not been used for over a. Answer is going to be time period. For example. land has not been used over a year over a century right over a a means answer is going to be singular so for over they might use the word more than for example the land has not been used more than a century more than and over they are the same thing so just focus over means the time period over something and all that question number 12 There was pressure to build a training center and a dash on the land. Two things. There was pressure to build. One thing is training center. Along with training center, whatever they say, that will be your answer. And by the way, for and sometimes they say as well as. There was pressure to build training center as well as hospital as well as whatever they say. Sometimes they say as well as. Sometimes they say also. right so any word that i mean answer is going to come with training center right after that then the next thing is uh okay question number 13 sponsorship has been received from a number of now underline number of whenever they use number of in ielts listening ielts reading it means answer is going to be plural right for number of they can replace it by any means for example number of for example if the answer is uh, ngos number of ngos in the audio they will say several ngos various ngos dozens of ngos so whatever they say like this that is for number of but remember answer will be plural clear now i play the audio for these three questions listen and answer You will hear a talk by a councillor on plans for the development of an old industrial site. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Councillor Norma Boyd, and welcome to this exhibition about the development of the old paper mill factory and gasworks site, which has been lying unused for more than a decade. There has been pressure on the council to use the land to build a training centre and a small business park. However, We have been encouraged by local people to create an open area for the benefit of the community, providing much needed space for recreation. And I now have pleasure in announcing that the plans for the creation of a park, to be called Park Royal, and for flats have now been approved. I'm also pleased to announce that we have secured sponsorship from local organizations. More detailed plans of the developments are available from the council website details of which are in your pack in the meantime i'd just like to take you through the plan here on the screen okay you know this is disastrous thing that you are waiting for the answer and audio is over <laughs> yes yeah, sometimes this happens your waiting answer is gone okay all right question number 11 yes over a our- and they use the word more than a decade d e c a d e and if your spelling is wrong your answer is considered wrong correct spelling decade okay question number 12 training center and a small business park now you can write small business park as full answer and by the way if the audio is fast you can just write the abbreviation for small you can write sml for business you can write bus for park you can write prk and later on you can write full form sir can we able to exclude the small word small business park sorry can i use bigger word 
Yes, yes, exactly. You can write your answer as business park or you can write it as small business park. But if you miss any word from business park, then your answer will be wrong because small is adjective. So if you miss the adjective, there is no problem, right? Uh, business park or small business park is the right answer. And the last question, yeah, they did not choose the word number of they only said local organizations, local organizations. Now you can write organization with S or with Z. Like in IELTS listening and reading and writing, you can use British spelling or American spelling. Right? Organization S and it is with Z. Okay, uh, now I'm going to play this one again. Please listen 11 to 13. You will hear a talk by a councillor on plans for the development of an old industrial site. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Councillor Norma Boyd, and welcome to this exhibition about the development of the old paper mill factory and gasworks site, which has been lying unused for more than a decade. There has been pressure on the council to use the land to build a training centre and a small business park. However... We have been in car Okay, training center or a small business park. Now, or is used for and. Now, keep that in mind also. Because without park, it's not clear. Huh? All right, let's go on. Encouraged by local people to create an open area for the benefit of the community, providing much needed space for recreation. And I now have pleasure in announcing that the plans for the creation of a park, to be called Park Royal, and for flats, have now been approved. I'm also pleased to announce that we have secured sponsorship from local organizations. We have secured sponsorship from local organizations. So local organizations will be the right answer. Okay, now let's go on. Questions 14 to 20, and we have a map. Label the plan below. They call it plan or a map. Uh, now, with this map, you can see they have not given us directions. East, west, north, south. If they give the directions, it's good. Otherwise, they use the word left, right, top, bottom. Okay, now tell me what is on the uh, top left corner. Top left corner. Question number? It's not theater, it's walled something. Top left corner. Theater is not corner. Top left corner. Okay, what is on the top right corner? Sports area. What is at the bottom left corner? Block of something. Okay, and what is at the bottom right corner? Question number? 20. Okay, and then in the middle, we have question number 16. Now remember, in IELTS listening, audio and questions, they are always in order. Okay, now over here, can you find question number 14? So first they will tell us about the name of the street. Question number 14 is the name of the street. And street is already written. So the word which is already written, you will not write that. Okay, after that question number 15, where is that? Block of dash. Now this is there, they say uh, in one corner there is educational center and the other top bottom, uh, left bottom corner. Uh, there's going to be that block of something. Now, whenever they use the word block of, it can be the plural word. For example, block of apartments, block of houses, block of something. Okay. So just focus the word block of and plural answer. After 15, they will take you to the middle of the map. Question number 16. So for that, they will say dash is in the middle of the map. Right? Or in the center of the map. Center, middle, whatever they say. Okay? So that is going to be question number 16. After that, question number 17. Outdoor something. For outdoor, they might use the word in the open air. Right? For example, if it is outdoor court, badminton court, outdoor badminton court. So for that, they will say, uh, there is a badminton court in the open air. In the open air means outdoor. And it is very close to sports area. So for question number 17, the answer is going to come with sports area and something outdoor. Then we have question number 18. Where is that? Vault something. So they might take you on the top left corner and they might give you the reference of theater. Right? Behind the theater or top left corner 
and that is walled something like you know we say walled city andrun lahore is called walled city so something that is going to come with the walls and finally we've got question no uh, question number 19 that is there for children something related to children like they can say park for children amusement park for children so something related to children so you will follow this order in the audio they are going to go like that and then educational center so they are going to come block wise one block another another one box another box educational center is there and question number 20 where is that workshops so in the workshops again bottom right corner there is going to be something like that now listen for maps mainly they use prepositions prepositions of place prepositions of location mainly they use prepositions along with prepositions we have some specific language for directions for example if you say sir i want to go to that place i say okay go straight take the first right turn and from there take the second left turn and you will find the building on your right or another good thing sometimes when you're going back home you can have google maps you know that gorgeous lady turn right on the next exit this and that so the language they use that language is ideal for ielts maps okay now we are going to start and first question 14 15 16 17 18 and 19 20 let's take a start if we start here at the bottom you can see parkside street where the main entrance to the park is on the left of i'm playing it again some most of you missed that part okay don't worry don't worry we're going to start from there they are starting from 14 if we start here at the bottom you can see parkside street where the main entrance to the park is on the left of the entrance in the bottom left hand corner of the plan there will be a block of 40 studio flats on the other side of the entrance there will be some workshops for local businesses there will also be another entrance here on the top right which leads into pear street here in the center of the park we will have an ornamental lake with paths radiating north south east and west to the different areas of the park in the top right hand corner just by the pear street entrance there will be a large sports area with two football pitches and four tennis and volleyball courts just here beside the pitches on the same side of the path will be an outdoor swimming pool now in the top left hand corner a walled flower garden is planned with a rockery and a water feature with walkways seats and lots of shady areas for the summer next to this a sculpture garden is also planned now let's see just here below the walled garden there will be a grassy amphitheater with a permanent covered stage for open air concerts we hope that local schools and colleges will use this theater to showcase student work in the bottom left hand corner of the plan you can see that above the block of flats there will be a play area for children and directly to the right of this just near the main entrance there will be a wild area more trees will be planted here and in the middle will be built an educational center for use by local schools to encourage children to take care of the wildlife and look after the trees and plants and finally in the bottom right hand corner of the park will be a cafe opening on to pear street and okay see that kitna acha samjha rahi hai abhi bhi samajh na aaye to fir kya kar sakte hain okay bottom left bottom right top right top left and all that okay question number 15 sorry 14 now park side is one word uh but over here we've got the limit of no more than 3 words even if you write it with a space it will be accepted but if the limit is one word only then you should write park side as one word park lane park side side or side d side s i d e side i'll play it again d d for doctor park side street okay then we've got question number 15 block of 
Forty studio flats. Flats. F L A T S. The other word for apartments. I'll play the audio again. Isi ko chalaunga. Okay, yeah, don't worry. Forty studio flats. You know studio flat? Ek hi kamra hai. Yahan pe bed hai, yahan pe kitchen hai, yahan pe bathroom hai, and all that. They call it studio flat, studio apartment. Okay, yeah. Jahan se shuru hota hai, wahi pe khatam ho jata hai. Forty studio flats. Okay, question number sixteen. Only lake will be wrong. Ornamental lake. Ornamental. Ornamental lake. Or lake is L A C K. L A K E. Very good. Some people write. I have lake of confidence, sir. Yeah, lake of confidence is wrong. Lack of confidence. Okay. Yeah. I went to Naran. There I saw lake Faisal Malook. Lack. That is lake. So ornamental lake. I'll play the audio again. Don't worry. After that, question number seventeen, and they talked about football pitches and this and that, and the word outdoor was not coming. Then she said outdoor swimming, swimming pool. pool. So swimming pool is one word. Uh, you can write it with a space even because it's no more than two words, three words. They will accept it. Otherwise, swimming pool is one word. Okay, let's go on. Question number eighteen. Yes, word flower garden. They use the word flower garden and above the theater, left corner and all that. Word, word is already written, so you will write flower garden. That's right, flower garden. Okay, then we've got question number nineteen. Play area. Yeah, they mentioned play area for children. So for children is already written. Play area will be the answer. Now let me tell you, they have further simplified aisles. Now what will they do? They will give you these words as A B C D. A play area, B this one, that one, that one, and you just have to write A B C D. Okay? But sometimes this is the old version, so you never know in your exam they give you old version or new version. You never know that, so you should be prepared by all means from book one to book sixteen, all the books. Okay, after nineteen, cafe. cafe. Question number twenty is cafe. Now please listen to it again, pay full attention. If we start here at the bottom, you can see Parkside Street, where the main entrance to the park is. On the left of the entrance, in the bottom left-hand corner of the plan, there will be a block of forty studio flats. On the other side of the entrance, there will be some workshops for local businesses. There will also be another entrance here. On the top right, which leads into Pear Street, here in the center of the park, we will have an ornamental lake with paths radiating north, south, east, and west to the different areas of the park. In the top right-hand corner, just by the Pear Street entrance, there will be a large sports area with two football pitches and four tennis and volleyball courts. Just here, beside the pitches on the same side of the path, will be an outdoor swimming pool. Now, in the top left-hand corner, a walled flower garden is planned with a rockery and a water feature with walkways, seats, and lots of shady areas for the summer. Next to this, a sculpture garden is also planned. Now, let's see. Just here. Below the walled garden, there will be a grassy amphitheater with a permanent covered stage for open-air concerts. We hope that local schools and colleges will use this theater to showcase student work. In the bottom left-hand corner of the plan, you can see that above the block of flats, there will be a play area for children, and directly to the right of this. Just near the main entrance, there will be a wild area. More trees will be planted here, and in the middle will be built an educational centre for use by local schools to encourage children to take care of the wildlife and look after the trees and plants. And finally, in the bottom right-hand corner of the park will be a cafe, opening on to Pear Street. And now for questions. 
Okay. Now, please come to next questions.